the ambitious railway project linking Egypt's Aswan city to Sudan's Wadi Halfa is finally back on track after over a decade's delay. Talks started in 2010, but the two uprisings here suspended talks till 2015. President Sisi relaunched the talks in Sudan, but an uprising there and the pandemic in 2020 delayed it again. The railway network will be a more convenient form of transport for passengers than the more expensive airlines or longer bus and ferry rides. But it will also promote economic ties between the North African neighbors. The freight trains link will strengthen bilateral trade as Egypt needs agriculture and livestock products from Sudan, as well as exporting various commodities and goods to Sudan. Egypt has built the first phase that reaches the borders with Sudan, but the 570 kilometers linking both countries is expected to include investments from the Kuwait Fund that is financing the feasibility studies. Once the Egypt and Sudan governments start construction, the project will take three years to implement from Aswan to Wadi Alpha, where there will be another station to Khartoum, while Aswan Line will reach Alexandria Station. No date has been announced for the inauguration of the project yet. The new railway is not just about Egypt and Sudan, but once it's established, officials here hope it will be the beginning of an ambitious plan to connect the whole of the Nile Basin countries with a railway network. Yes, Hakim for CGTN, Cairo.